Hey, what's going on guys? It's your favorite Mississippi Dipper right here. It's been one hell of a day. One hell of a day. I just I've only been awake for about like two, three hours right now. Two or three. Anyway, I've got a real surprise for you guys. Um one of our great friends over at Whitetail oh, sent me a can of Whitetail Smokeless Wintergreen. Now for some of you who don't know what Whitetail Smokeless is all about, they are a non-tobacco chew. Non-tobacco. Now what are you saying? It's like, well what do they make it out of? Well they make it out of mint leaves. And they have a lot of different ingredients in them. I'm just going to read it off the, it's on the back of the can too. So, if you want to know what you're what you're doing, um, it's organic mint leaf, vegetable glycerin, water, propylene glycol, natural and artificial flavors, xylitol, nicotine, and uh, keep it away from your children and pets if you have those, because you know you can't really it'll make them sick. Um, it also tells you how much nicotine is in the uh, the can. So I'm at full strength, 360 milligrams per gram, which I know that sounds like a lot, but um, milligrams to grams, it's like 3.6 grams of nicotine, which is lower than most, but it's still a good bit of nicotine. That's a lot of nicotine. Um, Something else you might not know about whitetail is that whitetail <clears throat> does not add any sugar or glucose or anything like that that's going to rot your teeth out. A lot of other dips like Copenhagen and Grizzly all have a sugar glucose in it to um, give you that black tar taste uh, or spit and that really sweet flavor is sugary can cause, you know, you keep it in your mouth a long time, it can cause you to rot your teeth out. That's why most, uh, the biggest problem with dipping is teeth rotting and teeth staining comes from the sugar glucose too. Um, just a little fun fact for you guys if you didn't know that. But hey, you know what we're gonna do? I've never tried whitetail. So you know what that means? That means we have got to open it up. And put it in my lip. Oh man. Now when I was talking to them, they said that they um, resembled their cut after Grizzly. So we're going to check that out. We're going to check that out. Just, you know, a little... Mm. Oh, let me show you guys here. The cut... I would say looks a little more like um, a little more like uh, Copenhagen than Grizzly, to be honest with you. It does smell good. It does smell good. All right, let's give us a nice hefty pinch here. It's mushy. It's very very mushy. Mm. Good thing I got my handy dandy spitting cap. Shout out to spitting cap. $9.99. 10 bucks to get you a spitting cap. Screws onto your bottle. No spill. I'm above the. If you're above the funnel line, you know where the funnel ends. It's going to spill out if you open the top, but if you're not, um, then you're good to go. Which actually means that I need to swap spitters here soon. Um, so it's got a good wintergreen burn, you know what I mean? That good wintergreen burn. Taste isn't like terrible or anything like that. I like it. The can's really cool. It's like chromed chromed out sticker on the top 
which I kind of like, and then it's a matte green around the uh, around the side, which is really cool. White tail. I don't know if any of y'all do this, but I always try to like line it up after I break the seal. Mmm. Really juicy. Oh, man. I tell y'all what, you mother luggers. This white tail ain't bad. Now I'll say when I pinched it, it does not have the consistency of tobacco leaves. It's mushier. All right, it's it's a lot like trying to grab a um, gel, I guess. And that may, you know, you're sitting there thinking it's like, oh, gel, oh, what the hell? I won't be grabbing on gel. Shit. Who in their right mind would want to grab on some mother loving gel? Oh, I want it. I want deep. Well, just saying. This gel ain't too bad. Um, I can dip this. I can dip this. It does have nicotine in it. It's about one and a half ounce weight. Manufactured out of Jefferson, Wisconsin. So all you cheeseheads out there, got yourself a nice little product. Not gonna lie, it's um. It's not, now I've tried, you know, some non-tobacco dips before. I've tried Smoky Mountain, and I'm going to be honest, Smoky Mountain, I would rate like a 1 out of 10 because it tastes, it's got the cut of a horse hair, and it tastes like spray paint. And it's mint leaves too. But this doesn't taste like spray paint. It has a lot more thickness than uh, Smoky Mountain in the cut. It's a longer cut, thicker cut, and um, it tastes good. It tastes really good. Now I've got Whitetail Wintergreen and I've got Whitetail Mint. Um, I'm not going to be doing the mint. I'm going to be sending that to my good buddy over at Carolina Dippers. But <clears throat> go hit like subscribe follow on instagram and y'all have a good one yeah y'all thought the video was over didn't you yeah you thought it was over <laughs> no the video's not over i actually do have something to tell y'all uh if y'all go and check out <clears throat> my wife's page which will be in the description at faith kenny 48 she's doing a giveaway for all you ladies and even guys, if you got a girlfriend, go check her out. She's doing a giveaway of a bunch, about $200 worth of beauty supplies. Hmm. And uh, all you have to do to enter is follow all the members of United Dippers crew and like all of their posts. Now, that may seem like a lot, but think about it. $200 worth of free beauty supplies you can use for yourself. You can use to give to your girlfriend, your wife, your mother, and make you a kink. Okay, that's a lot of stuff. And it's all picked out by a woman who knows her shit. So, that's a good thing right there. Um, <clears throat> the other thing is... The rating of Whitetail Smokeless Wintergreen. Anyway, uh, White Tail Smokeless Wintergreen, I'm going to rate an 8 out of 10. Uh, it packs well in your mouth, doesn't slide around, doesn't taste bad, has a good flavor to it. The only thing I really don't like about it is, you know, that it's, it's jelly when you pick it up. It's the only thing I don't like about it. But other than that, it's a great dip. I would buy it again. I would definitely dip it again. So, y'all pick you up a can of White Tail wintergreen smokeless now you can like and subscribe y'all take it easy